Dash cams. Why do we need them? I'm going to show you some clips of incidents that happened to me while I was driving. In my last three cars, I've had a dash cam. In my 2010 Soul, I had a cheap but decent camera. When I got my 2019 Soul, I upgraded to the Thinkware F200 dash cam. Much nicer camera and a lot more options on it. I've now installed that camera in my 2018 Tucson. If you're involved in an accident or an incident on the road, you don't always have a witness. A dash cam is a great impartial witness for an accident involving you or maybe even others around you. The footage may save you a lot of grief if you're involved in an accident or an incident. The camera footage will show exactly what happened. There's no bias towards you or the other driver. It just shows the facts. It can go your way or the other driver's way. It can show if the other driver cut in front of you. Did an illegal and very dangerous pass on the highway. Ran a red light. Or turned left in front of you. The footage shows exactly what happened and when. As most cameras now have date and time stamps on them. Some cameras like the one in my car will even record incidents when the car is unattended and turned off. If it senses motion or an impact, it will record. I've had a dash cam in my car now for about four years. Sometimes with your dash cam, you'll catch footage of an old car, something you might be interested in, in uh, having a better look at. I've used uh, dash cam footage as B-roll in some of my videos. I've only had one incident where I may have needed dash cam footage. Last summer on the highway at night, I collided with a moose. I do have footage. And you can check out the video up here, if you're interested. When I called the insurance company, I told them I had dash cam footage of the accident. Uh, they said it's always great to have dash cam footage of any accidents. But it wasn't required in this instance, because it was an animal vehicle collision. So there was no fault there. And they also had to report from the police when the RCMP responded to my accident. It's very easy to install a dash cam. Most just mount onto your windshield with a suction cup and a wire goes down to the 12 volt socket in the dash. With a little more effort you can hide your wires and wire it right into the fuse box. That's what I did in this car. I got a video you can check out right here if you're interested in that one. Some vehicles are now coming with built in dash cams and all around cameras. I think this is a good thing. In the comments below, let me know if you use a dash cam. Have you ever needed the footage? What are your thoughts on dash cams? Let me know. Thanks.